What up, world? Scale Auto Customizer coming to you from the Big Easy Garage. It's been a really long time since I said that. Um, I haven't been keeping up with my channel much. Um, I finally looked at it, and then it's been two years. Two years since I uploaded a video. And I've been getting the itch lately. Now, the reason I've been gone for so long is... Back in 2014, it's actually going on three years now, I took a job to where I move around a lot, um, different cities and states, and it takes up a lot of my time. But I did bring a lot of my models with me, and as you can see, if any of y'all happen to remember, I got the 76 uh, Chevy shop truck, the 65 Chevy truck I was working on, and the two in the background, my 48-hour build. Um, I believe that was Chevy Cheeseburger's first 48-hour build, if I'm not mistaken. If I'm mistaken, please correct me. Um, and, of course, the GTO, I believe it's a 65, that I built before I really started this channel. Um, I've been getting the itch to build a lot again lately, so I've been dusting some stuff off, and some stuff's not so dusted off. <laughs> but, um... I plan to revitalize this channel and start doing more builds and stuff. Um, just seeing the love, even after two years, there's still people commenting on my, my videos. I'm still getting subscribers. That is awesome. So I definitely will have more coming very soon. I'm going to get back into the swing of things. I'm probably going to start with the 65 over here. Um, if you notice, the 65 doesn't have a bed on it. Um, one of my videos a, a while back when I first got my airbrush gun, I was learning the airbrush, you know, and all that, and the bed didn't come out too great. So I dunked the bed in the purple pond, forgot it was in there until like a week later. I get back and it was gelatin. So there's no bed for that. I guess I'm just going to have to scratch build it. I tossed around the idea for quite a while. At first I was going to do like an ice cream truck, like a good humor style, but more call it bad humor. Um, and build like an ice cream truck bed on the back and all and put a blown engine in it. But I have a different idea now, and I think it's going to be really cool. Uh, I'm going to scratch build the whole bed. Uh, I'm going to keep it a surprise, let y'all give y'all something to look forward to. If, if y'all want to see it, please check back. That's the one I'm going to start first. I'm, the, the main thing I'm going to do with that one is the, the, the bed is going to be the main customizing I do. Uh, I'm, I'm searching eBay right now. I need to find a, a rear axle for this when I messed up the rear axle so if I can find a rear axle it'll work out great I'm searching around eBay uh, I've already tried Revell their parts um, broken parts deal where you can get parts or whatever but they don't have anything for this one anymore so if if need be I can make it work the way it is but uh, I'm trying to search out that 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 rear end on on eBay, but anyway, that's really the only customizer I'm planning on doing. It's going to be a pretty basic build, but it's going to be I think it's going to be pretty cool. Um, and y'all remember this one here? This was actually my last video was update number two on this truck. It was supposed to be for the Fast Jimmy seventy one tribute build. I haven't forgot about that. That's still the intention for this truck. I may be late, like really late, but that's still the intention for this truck. This truck will be a tribute to Fast Jimmy, uh, Jimmy 71, excuse me, who I think is one of the greatest model builders in the YouTube community. Um, I'm going to wrap this video up because I'm just going to keep it short. This is a little reintroduction back into the community. So... Check back often for updates. Um, there will be updates coming. I'm going to try and make a video this weekend. I'm going to try and get this truck here painted at 65. And uh, if I can get it painted up, I'll start scratch building the, the bed of what I'm going to do. So, like I said, just check back for updates. Um, scale Auto Customizer coming from, well, the not-so-big-easy garage anymore, but it's still the big-easy garage. All right, I'm out.